hey, to me. You ain't never took up for me. None of that type of shit. I don't know why. Wet 100 and JT the bigger figure, aka Fig Panamera, get the business clip. Go on, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and get active down in them comments. Rumor, naughty network. Now, nah, really? You know they look up. You ain't depending on them to do what you do, but you still do what you do. Well, I don't depend on you what I do, I still do what I do. Yeah. What do they think they got me figured out? Boom, I'm selling diapers. I'm selling I'm a, right? So, yeah. that's just what it is. So, yeah, I don't know who be pumping it. We ain't never had no words. I thought you was crazy as a mother for the Alan Grumblack. I thought you was out of your mind. I got the information from Alan Grumblack. And guess what? Let me let me tell you from my perspective. I they spent, told me you wanted to watch. Nope. I spent twelve I spent twelve thousand on production studio. I spent yeah. on the double XL ad. I spent about another five, six, seven thousand on promo. Listen, the quarter thing I wasn't mad about. What I was mad about was cut yourself all the way out of the run but you probably didn't know nope this is what i knew right here this is gonna be so mad i'm gonna get a cease and desist any day now let me cash out and don't be greedy if they get all the money i tried to sell it to game game said i give you seventy five thousand. i'm like bro they just gave you all that money i want 250. game said i give you seventy five thousand and go away I say, no, I'm not taking 75,000 game. Come on, gang. Then he had that nigga Jimmy Henchman hit me. Hey, this Jimmy Henchman, whoop the whoop. I'm like, oh. don't work with us over here. I say, N I borrow money from just from Fillmore to pay for the. I got an answer to some hood and gang bangers about this money. I'm going to the white man. I I'm felt like I, you should have stayed at least 30%, 25% of that back end run. I wasn't mad about the quota thing up front. Because the quarter men, I'm like, I'm I'm new new on the spin. A dub of 30 is doing what you was doing, right? I knew that, right? So I said, now, I don't know what you did with your publishing. You sold that too? Man, I said, just give me the money. I'm a hood. So, okay, nigga. now, listen. I'm out of here. Keep it real. You knowing what you know now. I would have negotiated different, but this is what I was scared of. your pub, nigga. This is what I was scared of. A lawsuit tying up the money, and I don't even get the 250. I'm like, man, take this. I'm out of here, nigga. I'm going back to film motion. <laughs> and look, then I took the other album, went to Navarre. They gave me another 250. <laughs> oh, you got it? I didn't know about that play. I came back to film over with a half a million dollars. I was the richest in my hood. I cashed everybody out. Still had about 300 left. I pissed everybody off. I knew. I think. The blood said they gonna be Jimmy Henry gonna give them. I owe Phil more gang members. I'm gonna get some money and come back with the trophy. <laughs> Yo, that's a nice spot right there, though, bro. Huh? That's a nice spot right there, you got. Yeah, bro. I I, I just cashed it out. I say, man, I'm putting my money like fifty me square feet that joint. You know what? I'm not exactly. I feel like you damn near thirty walking around. Here. Boy, it's a, it's a lot of rooms and it's a lot of it's a lot of space. And the thing with the studio, that part would make me put the money in because now nigga could record and do product and still film podcast room we got a showcase room i'm like that i'm in atlanta nigga and there ain't no nigga in atlanta so what this. you been doing listen i can remember you was down there doing trap flicks with big face down in the cedars years ago right yep yep 2015 is it like a a a, a, a a, a subscription based thing or? man that's free i'm getting paid off the commercials way more than youtube i know tubi once i get my subscribers up but i got my own platform i got it built from scratch i got the app oh, is it up? it's up right now you can download it you got an iphone you can see that right now my it's only like, just iphone and that's where they cross the board android will be up in probably four five more days they just submitted it well hit me up you know i got the people that know how to get to you know okay well then yeah let's, 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 let's shock the world and show them, man we right, listen bro you ain't no, i've been telling i ain't got no more politics i just thought this deal was crazy on the back end that's just what i said come on and you know what i'm like what are you mad at me for do he know i ain't I'm mad broke? at you i, I, I was broke niggas imagine the poor niggas the question, here. Right, listen, if they ask you a question though jt what you think about that that's just what you think about it. 
That's right. But it's that's why it be like fifty niggas could get their opinion. It's cool. Soon as Wack One Hundred give his opinion, all hell break loose. Crazy as a mother. Y'all been talking about this for five months. <laughs> I get one opinion, and it's going crazy. They want everybody. I'm like, nigga, what the fuck? Just my opinion. If you don't agree, it. Nah, I say really? some stuff you like. Maybe I say something to help you. Maybe I don't, but God, it's just opinion. It's an opinion. Nah, and look, you shocked the world by hitting my live right now. I'm like, that ain't whack, nigga. He don't oh, like me. I kept, no, that's him. him. Down there saying, whoop, 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 whoop. If a Memphis hit me, ask me, whack, why you put me on to this? I said, I don't know nothing about it. I asked Adam. I text Adam. Adam was no jumping out. He said, I don't know what you're talking about. I sent him a screenshot of what the Memphis sent me. Um, and he's like, nah, I don't know what this is. I said, oh, okay, well, somebody asking me down south, can they be a part of it? I don't know. I don't know. Adam, Adam ain't got to check in with me. Well, what the he doing with his brand? A lot yes. of people talk to me about, a lot of don't. But if you hit me, Adam, if you got something going on, these cats is hit me, let me know so I can direct it. Nah, real. Right? And guess what I told him when I text him? I say, Adam, this is your brand. I've registered NoJumperSouth.com and got the software about to go on there. I'm going to give it to him. If Yo, he don't right. want it. But you know that's the word. But I told him it's his. It's his. But guess Yo, what I told him? But, you, but the order is out of order. But this is what I like about the situation, why I, why I could come public and talk about it. I was trying to show him love and, and surprise him with a bundle package of everything in one wop. I got so many finna pull up to this bitch. But I told him, I said, nope, we gonna take the no jumper off. We gonna keep trap licks. And I'm gonna just show him what I could do. But I was saluting him because he the first to get my life story and made the whole world want to know who I was again. Gotcha. So it wasn't but, about me calling. Trap you can download on the, at the app store. At the app store for free, no subscription, no registration. I'm gonna check it out. But now I had to come on here, bro. And uh, cause I'm tired of my talking about if we want to see something tonight. All right, if you want to see something like, bro, I ain't got nothing to get that, man. That nigga ain't did nothing to me ever. I know a bunch of bait niggas that say, but it's a bunch of niggas that say me. So what that mean? Nigga ain't did me nothing, so nigga ain't did nothing to me. And cold part about it, I've been gone from the Bay for 14 years. If there's anybody mad at me up there, they just hate me. Nigga, I went and made field more. Like, like the Crips and the Bloods came down south, I came and brought field more, put that all over, nigga. And I'm not a gang member at all. So I got you take it to Africa. Oh, uh, I see you take it to Africa. I said, I respect the nigga. You, nigga. you know, I just went and got the little fever shot in my back on. Two days ago, I'm on my way to the Congo. Come on, man. Yeah, so you know. And I was in nothing but the hoods over there. I ain't had no security, no police, no soldier. All my footage see me with the worst. Is, that nigga JT is the street nigga for real. I know politics. I know body language. Where you I was know. at? Nigeria somewhere? Where'd you go? I was in Nigeria, in Kenya, and Burkina Faso. Hey, nigga, you could buy a whole mother crib for 65000 in Kenya. I bought me 10 acres of land over there. I built now, water. I'm going to buy some shit over there. I see some big ass crib. Phillips. Yes. 55,000. I'm going to go buy. I'm going to go buy a whole bunch of them. Yes, bro. That's the play. That's. The... I went over there and found out. The dual dual citizenship up everywhere. In a minute, America. Oh, you be real. Listen, JT. What we going to do? Go to Miami. Go to New Orleans. did all this. So it's like, it's cool. It's home. But the nigga, I'm going to challenge myself with the other side of the world. That's I can come back here, we know what it is, but over there, it's a bunch of new that I want to explore on, on, on my next, you know, and my listen, next. When I went and put Filmo Africa, everywhere I went, I built a water well and I gave out that food. You could feed a thousand people for a thousand dollars, nigga, and you'll be like the champ of the village. So that's all I kept doing was showing love. I've met all the rappers. I paid them for features. I got them niggas on my products. But Africa, though, definitely, that, that's something you're going to love when you get over there, for sure. Yeah, I got to go get my malaria pills tomorrow. Okay, look at this. I'll probably be in Cali in the, in the next two, three days. If you're still here, I'm going to come. Yeah, pull up to the studio, bro. I'm going to come pull, pull up, up on you. Nigga, like, like, bro, like, bro, listen, hit me, bro. These niggas be saying, I be hearing stories about me I never heard, bro. <laughs> I, I had to come, come on here tonight, front of the world, like, look, nigga. You ain't never did a motherfucking thing to me. You ain't never took nothing from me. 
none of that type of stuff. At the end of the day, I don't know what these niggas is talking about. I just had an opinion about the deal, the details I heard. That's it. That's right. And I'm not even mad at you, bro, because you definitely said the rice was absolutely crazy. But when you get my opinion, nigga, you so are that time being pop who you was younger the game. Nigga, nigga got that quota thing in front of you. You like, and you know you got another one, you go get another quarter for. That looked at me like you, you use that one to set the value for the next one. That's exactly what I did. I, <laughs> <laughs> make, it makes sense though, I didn't know that. Yep. And, and if you owe hella hood niggas and you don't got no income, no money, but you own these masters, you better turn that into money for yourself and get your niggas paid. And I became a champion in Filmo for that play. That nigga JT held on to the masters. I went to see Dr. Dre. I talked to gang. JT, I talked to 50 I shit. bought this 20 years ago. All this was dirt, JT. 20 years ago. I brought this was dirt. I built all this. Come on, man. That's beautiful too. I don't wear gold chains and a bunch of diamonds, but I, I, I put something in this one of five clips. You know, I want to go get me a spot in London. You know, end of the day, it's about assets, it's about you know resources. I got a financial team that's crazy. That's the secret to my success. You know, I got a lot of you know our contacts is what it is. You know, we can go broke today, get on the phone, and touch a couple million. It ain't nothing. Cause our yeah. contacts resources, so yeah. Fuck it, bro. I had to come on here. Whenever you come back, hit me up, bro. Pull up on me. We sit out, nigga. Talk some business. We might put together whatever. Me and Ray J got we to try to come together. That's so unorthodox. Cause what I'm bringing to the table, most niggas don't got the trademarks, the domain, the software, and software and platforms is the future. When and you I go to the trap, what you? I see what you're doing with your kids. Look like your kids is working with you too. I see yep. That. I'm so happy that he chose, or right, I'm gonna come with you, dad. I ain't gonna hang with these niggas. Yeah, you come be do this. Any nigga who kid is little or tiny after them is a failure. Nigga, I, nigga that's my nigga. If your kid is named after you banging, you fail, nigga. That's a fact. True, true story. That's supposed to be better than us, the opposite of us. Damn. That's why I work for this. That's why I'm from. I'm promoting his ass. I'm like, nigga, you the only I'll one. You, our, you the only one in our family that no software, nigga. Come run Traflix. I say, boy, I got five thousand for you. Quit your job. He said, I'm quitting. I'm gone. I'm coming with my dad. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga said, I quit. That was two days ago. Now he in Atlanta and he made three hundred on his first day. I think he had five yeah. right now. I'm proud of them. Sell channels, nigga. We selling channels on our platform. I'm, I'm gonna go download you. Check it out, bro. Yeah, check, check it, it out. And I'm gonna hit you. Pull up on us. I got a whole media team on Clubhouse. Pull up on the hundred side. Come promote you in your link. You know you'll pick up a whole lot of shit. I'm coming. I'm gonna text you my number so you got my number. All right, love. All right, salute, my G. All right. Well, there you got it, people. No more uh, questions. No more uh, asking. You know what's the status, nigga? He just came on here and said it. So y'all quit saying, that was whack that did it, nigga. No, nigga. We got to respect Adam 22. We going to respect Adam. I came and bring a surprise to Adam. But he didn't like the surprise. So therefore, that's called respect. Hey, man, can't nothing but some good come from this. Whack and JT get the business clip. If it ain't no problem, why we gotta act like it's one? Two hustlers, two OGs, two reputables from what I know. And I know a lot of y'all might be looking for the play, but sometimes we make a play instead of running one. Or we run one with you instead of running one on you. You wanna make allies or make enemies? You might not mind making both, but which one makes more sense? Cooler heads are prevailing. Let's see if y'all promo that. Hey man, shout out to Wack 100, shout out to Fig Panamera. Go get your kids some incredible diapers and watch you a movie on Trap Flicks. As always, I appreciate y'all tapping in. And if you made it this far in the video, y'all the real MVPs and I appreciate y'all the most. I identify as a multimillionaire. Real Naughty Network. Like, comment, subscribe.